I love you too. Aiden, what are you doing? Um, a we helped set up the fort there. And got, we didn't help the fort of this. We still have a bear in the park. And we are where we still have a witch of the earth. Put the spider up last. And we have a whole list of done. Oh, yeah? Oh, now I need to end end the video and stop recording. Um, no. What you want to record in the video? I called my toy Get down, sis. Are You're you? gonna fall. All right, so we're just getting started. I'm really not sure what we're doing this year, to be honest. Uh, got the fence up, uh, kind of. There's still a lot. I haven't done any of the touch-up work on the fence. I haven't put the skulls on the fence yet. Uh, you can see like the poles that are all scratched up. There's some uh, some of the wood's been chewed on by rats. We had a rat issue in the backyard this this year. They ate pretty much everything in our garden. They ate. Uh, we didn't get anything out of the garden. No, nothing. Not a single vegetable this year. Because the rats ate it all. Temperance, you need to get out of the road or I'm going to spank you. Come on. Get out of the road. Anyway. So, uh, yeah. So, the the window covers. I just put those on. Uh, I never did make a window cover for this window. Not sure if I'm going to. Uh, we've got a projector that we might put in that window. I haven't decided if I'm going to do something. Sis. You want to record? Uh-huh. I want to hold the phone. I want to record. Maybe later. Not right now. I want to record my bed. Uh, so, I don't know if we're going to put anything uh, to cover that window or not, like we did the others. Uh, I think I might and just leave it, uh, like, sparingly, not do a whole lot. That way you can still see through it. Uh... So anyway, whenever I was pulling the window covers, I had them stacked up on top of the shed in the backyard, the fence. So we had two sheds. We got the little shed, and then we got the big shed. The fence was on top of the big shed. The window covers were stacked on top of the little shed. Uh, I took the fence down first, put that up. When I went to get the window covers down, uh, in between all the wood, so they're all stacked on top of each other. In between all the wood that had been filled in with grass, and whenever I went to pull it down, uh, there was probably 20, maybe 30 rats jumping out of, in between all that. So that's why we didn't get anything out of the garden. They literally made their nest right next to the garden. Uh, there were ears of corn that were in with the grass. So they were stealing our corn and putting it in the grass. Uh, so yeah, I'll, I'll put a bait station out back there. Uh, again, I'm not really worried about it. We've never had them in the house. We had a couple mice uh, this year. Like, I've already taken care of those guys. The rats can't get in. There's nothing big enough for them to get in. No holes big enough. Temperance! Out of the road! Kid doesn't listen at all today. Can I record my bad dream? You had a bad dream? Yeah, because yeah. Aiden wanted to watch a scary movie yesterday and have a bad dream. After I told him he was going to have a bad dream, and he said he wasn't going to. Yeah, and then I did. I was supposed to find up my window, and when Team Cat got a thing, and... I don't know if y'all can hear him or not. And I'm uh, having a ghost is going up my window. There are ghosts going up his window. Anyway, so what I was saying, you know, I after I got attacked by the rats... Happy. Like, literally, they were jumping off and, like, hitting me on the shoulder and stuff. So, that was cool. The chickens started chasing them. So, that was funny. Uh, anyway, so we got these three window covers on. I might make a window cover for that. Uh, tombstones, normally I dig them into the ground and then, like, bury them on the base to where they're all crooked and whatnot. That's a lot of work. And it tears up the damn yard. So, I haven't really decided what I'm doing. 
uh, it's really the only way to keep them from blowing away, and it looks a heck of a lot better than just setting them there. So I don't know. I'm kind of torn on whether I want to do that again this year or not. I, I really don't want to dig up the yard. It's a lot of work. Uh, but yeah, this is what we've got done so far. Not a lot. It did take quite a while. Uh, this, this fence is not easy to put up, mainly because my ground is super hard. Hence the reason the water sprinkler is going. Uh, tomorrow is the 1st of October. So really we're, we're a bit late this year. We haven't done anything Halloween wise. Uh, haven't started on any projects. Uh, I never finished the rest of the fence I started making last year. I've got I think five panels that were never finished that were supposed to go on that side of the yard. I might try to finish that. Uh, I'm working crazy hours now, so don't really have a lot of spare time. Uh, so I'd love to make a coffin, but I don't think I'm going to have the time to do so. Uh, so yeah, we got to figure out what we're doing with tombstones. We'll probably just hang the pumpkins back up this year. Uh, last year we didn't put out the clowns, if I remember right. We just put out the skeletons. In the pumpkins. Uh, I've got a cool idea for the projector this year for inside the garage. That's all going to come down to if I can get the fish tank sold. I've got two fish tanks in there that are up for sale. A 110 gallon that is uh, $200 and a uh, 60 or a 40 gallon that is $60. Uh, I got to get those sold. They're in the way. Uh, I would like to have the garage open this year and just on the front part of the garage we got a lot of crap in there so I uh, can't do the whole garage but I would really like to do a small display in there with stuff that we can't leave outside so that on Halloween we could just open the garage and we have a display already set up in there and I got a really cool idea for a projector system uh, to make a hologram but again we got to get those fish tanks sold to be able to have the space to do it. Right, Aiden. Do you know anybody that wants to buy a big fish tank? No? Well, if you know anybody that needs one, uh, or if you want one, you know, just saying. Uh, and for a small fee, I'll even deliver it just to get it out of there. It's not going to be free because my truck uses a lot of gas. So. And, um,. I have already a big fish tank with frogs in there and fish. Yeah, you got a 50 gallon in your room that's got frogs in it. And fish. It does have two fish in it, I think. It has your big one fish died. Too. Did you notice that? The big fish died? What kind? The, the big koi that we put in there. By big koi, I mean it was like three inches long. This, is this oh, it was that big? Wow, that's pretty big for your fish tank, Bubba. Anyway, gotta go. Bye.